Hey guys, Coach Kara here, and it is time to take your measurements. So I want to show you how to do that. First, I want to mention that we want measurements in cm's, not inches. Okay, cm's, and we want your weight in kilos. Okay, so remember those two points. It's all in the K2Fit official account in case you forget. We're going to use all the measuring points here, which is also in the account, so you don't have to print off. I just wanted to show you that is available to show you exactly how to do your measurements. All right, so I'm going to give you a demo with my good friend Paul. Come on in here, buddy. Okay. All right, and we're going to do each point, okay, the circumference around. So we're starting with shoulders. So you're going to go around your buddy's shoulders, right there. You want it tight, but not too tight, and you don't want it too loose either. So just gently tight there. Okay, take that measurement, you go to the next point. We're gonna do chest, so arms out to the side. Once you go around, you're gonna go right in with nipple line. If you're not that comfortable with friends, you can go over here, don't worry. And I want you to put your arms down and relax. That's the position you take it, okay? So arms down, relaxed, good to go. Now we're gonna do arms, so whatever arm you choose. Whatever arm is up to you, your more, more dominant side, okay? What's your more dominant? Okay, right? So first, we're gonna do it in a non-flex position, and you're gonna do it the biggest part of the biceps, or biggest part of the arms. And so you've measured that. After you've done that, I want you to do a big flex. Flex as hard as you can, show those big muscles, excellent. Right at the top of the peak, make sure you get the biggest part of the arm, perfect. All right, now we're moving on to waist. So you're gonna measure just above the hip bone at the smallest point of your waist, all right? So you're going around, okay? You can come to the side and just make sure you're all set and it's the same all the way around. And we're gonna do hips. So I want your hands out in front and feet together. Yes, perfect. And for the hips, you come around the side, it's easier. And you're gonna come down so you're around the biggest part of your friend's bum. Don't worry, it's all good. <laughs> I'm sure your friend won't mind. There you go. Okay, and then you're gonna do your dominant side is your right. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm gonna do your right thigh and right calf. So I'll just stay here. I'll get your shoulder width apart. So yeah. And uh, because he's wearing shorts, I'm gonna get you to bring your shorts up because it's easier to see where the muscle is or where the body fat is. For men, try and go right around the middle. Okay right around the middle there. For women, because we carry more body fat higher in the thigh, go at the biggest part of the thigh because that's where you're gonna see the change, that's where you're gonna see body fat come off, all right? So we wanna measure that part. And then for the calf, down here, staying on the dominant side, okay? Right around the biggest part of your calf. And you're all good. Great stuff. Perfect, thank you so much, Paul. That's exactly how you do your measurements before and after the challenge, and you're gonna see some awesome change, guys. Have any questions, do let me know.